but again, it's quite interesting property. But really decent space. You'll get the sun most of the day here as well. We're south facing, looking that way that we're looking now. So the sun will follow us around all the way to the afternoon. As so we come into this really lovely garden, this is the unusual part about this apartment. Find the apartment with a really nice garden, and this has got that. So, as I said, it's south facing, so it's really sunny. The time is now about half past three. And that sun is beaming in to this garden here. I think you've probably got that certainly till about seven, eight o'clock, maybe a little bit later in the summer. It's a really pleasant private garden. A little water feature, lots of nice shrubs and plants, and a little patio area here. Door that leads into the conservatory and door that leads into the kitchen. Property's never been let, it's been lived in pretty much all the time. And I said, having the garden here makes it a very nice, viable living property, as well as equally as many are in Headland Road, holiday let, or investment properties. Right, let's take you in and show you uh, inside. Okay, so we're now inside the apartment. What we've done is we've actually come to the front of the property um, to the main front door effectively. That's the front again. You come up these steps. We would just stand out there with a the video, the first part of the video, come up the steps. Here's a little balcony that we access from the bedroom and into the front door. Nice entrance hall, nice and bright light. We've got a relaxed window above us. Gives some nice degree of light. Also we've got the door and the window to the front there as well. To the Left of us here is a um, shower room. So we've got a walk-in shower cubicle, a little WC and a wash down basin. Through to the bedrooms. Two good doubles. There's one here. Plenty of power points, TV points. You've got room for a wardrobe and a chest of drawers there to our right. Again, we've got this window to the double glazed windows to the front, and there's a sea view between the houses. Or a sea glimpse, I should really say. Underfloor heating throughout, so each room is thermostatically controlled, so you set the temperature independently in each room. Just before we go into the just sorry, just before we go to the main bedroom is a little storeroom in here. And then bedroom one, very light and bright. That's one thing that's noticeable about this apartment, how bright it is. In here, we've got the window to the side and a door to the front, which opens out onto this balcony. You'll get the morning sun here as it rises up over this area here. So if you didn't want breakfast on your balcony, then this is the place to do it. So that's Headland Road. Again, it's a good mix here of main homes, some holiday lets and some investment properties. That block you see directly in front of us are all flats. I think the majority are all holiday let. The Gwell Martin apartments are next to us there, the red brick ones. A good chunk of those are holiday let and actually some are lived in and some are investment properties. We've got houses here which are lived in. And then further up another uh, block of apartments which are all second homes bar one, I believe, or all holiday lets bar one. But as you can see, it's a nice quiet road actually, and you've got easy access down onto Carbis Bay Beach from here. So with this bedroom one, we've also got a ensuite with a bath, electric shower over, we've got the wash hand basin and a WC. into the lounge. Great size lounge, nice wood floor, a 
Again, we've got a window to the rear, one to the side, and we've got double doors there out into the little conservatory. Plenty of power points in here. Little wall-mounted electric fire, TV points. And then into the conservatory. into the lounge and then through to the kitchen. So that's the door to the rear garden that I have shown you earlier. We've got in here a integrated dishwasher. We have an integrated dryer, an integrated washing machine, sink unit. Behind us here in this larder area is the fridge freezer. Plenty of power points, plenty of uh, worktop space. It's a decent size kitchen so great apartment very spacious very light great location they had the benefit of one decent sized parking space we've got that lovely garden to the rear i think it's uh i think it's a great little house this a great little apartment in a great little location and something worth thinking about if you're wanting to buy a little bolt hole in the area, perhaps buy a uh, second home or holiday let in the area, or equally a really nice place to live in, this would be it. So for more information, please give us a call. Look out for any open days that we may have. Uh, we'll advertise those on the major portals, etc., and our own websites of www.crossestates.co.uk. And if you give us a call and you want any questions answered, we'll be more than happy to help. Thanks.